Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, as you can see, I'm kind of cold here, so I've got this shawl <laughs> wrapped around. Um, but anyways, today I wanted to start um, the sort of vlog that's going to be probably a series of, of days, um, sort of wrapping up my discussion on the parasite that I have. Uh, following up on that and letting you know what's the outcome following my, the parasite cleanse that I did a couple of months ago. So I'll link my video somewhere here um, and you can follow my journey of trying to heal from Blastocystis hominis. So that's the parasite that I was um, originally um, diagnosed with and after taking antibiotics um, and different types of treatments like I wasn't able to cure myself from it and so I took matters into my own hands after doing a lot of research um, and did the Paragard parasite cleanse for 10 days. Um, since then I've not retested for the parasite because most of the time these it's, it's very hard to get this kind of test done through the NHS. I would have had to already sort of been going to my private GP and talking to them about it. And so I wanted to find a company that does a private test for, for the parasite, but then it turned out to be like very expensive in the UK. So I'm currently in Poland and I am going to actually purchase a test, which is like an at-home test here. It comes out to 349 Polish zloty, which is 67.6 Pounds. So it's about half of the price that I would pay um, in the UK. So what I'm going to show you is my process of ordering the test, receiving the test, like kind of what the test looks like. Disclaimer, of course, I'm not going to show you how I take my sample or I'm, and I'm not going to show you the, the actual sample, like the tube with the sample in it. I'll just show you the test, like what it looks like in the original package when it arrives and then i'll show you the results of the test so the website that i'm going to order the test from is from diagnostica so it's diag.pl um, and it's an at-home test so they send it to you you take your sample and you send it back into the lab and then they uh, test for parasites they have two different packets so i'm gonna get the more basic one so this one that i'm gonna get tests for six different types of parasites, Giardia lam lambia, Entamoeba histolica, Cryptosporadium, Blastocystis hominis, Dientamoeba fragilis, and Cyclospora something. Those are the ones it tests for, but the one I'm obviously most interested in is the Blastocystis hominis. Hey guys, so here's what the package looks like for the test, um, the stool sample that I'm going to collect. Obviously, I'm just going to show you the package and all of the things that come inside unused, so pre-taking the sample, and then I'll just show you the results of the test. So let me open this up. So it looks like we have gloves, um, like a sort of swab so i'm guessing that is how the sample is going to be taken i'm guessing that is where the sample is going to be put into uh there's like a little catcher that's interesting um i'm assuming there is some paperwork in here as well so let me leave all of that because that should be sort of sterile and here is paperwork so i kind of have this little packet here explaining some things about the offer. Here is a voucher for the test that I ordered. So I'm guessing that, yes, it says here that I need to put this in the package along with the test. Um, here is some information that I need to fill out, like my address, my uh, identification number, name, etc., and a, an instruction manual. So that's gonna come in super handy. Last but not least, there is a 
like DHL sticker. Hey guys, so I have the results of my parasite test back. So let's have a look and see, was I able to get rid of my parasite with the Paraguard and some of the other things that I was doing that I'll explain to you after we see the results. So guys, I just want to show you here my previous test results uh, that I had done in 2021. It says, you know, parasite test with fecal matter uh, positive, right? You see here it says dodatni. Uh, let me try to point. That means positive, that they found a parasite uh, in the fecal matter. And then it says that they found blastocystis, right? Um, so let's go to my updated test results for the kit that I took um, earlier this. Okay, so basically I had to put in the number, like the reference number of my uh, test that I had done. That's when I registered it. So I'm going to go here and I'm going to... Okay guys, there you have it. The first one, Blastocystis hominis negative they did not find blastocystis hominis in my uh, sample so you guys can see i'm super happy they didn't find it so that means that i was able to get rid of my blastocystis hominis so guys just as a reminder though i wanted to maybe run you through what I did exactly. So basically I did a run one round of the Paraguard. At the same time, I was taking um, activated charcoal. I was taking NAC and, and acetylcysteine for immune support. Um, I was taking vitamin D, vitamin B. You know, I was taking just some vitamins to help with my overall immune system so I can fight the bug off. Then as soon as I finished the Paraguard, I started to take um, oil of oregano. So I did one round of oil of oregano. Just I had one bottle. Uh, I think there was, if I'm not mistaken, like 20 or 30 uh, capsules in there. And I took them twice a day with a meal. Uh, and so that is also supposed to be quite parasite fighting oil of oregano. So I kind of did like a double treatment, I would say, right? With the Paraguard and then with the oil of oregano. Um, while I was taking the oil of oregano, I continued taking the, the NAC, the N-acetylcysteine. Um, I was using the doctor's best brand. It was really, really good. I liked it a lot. Um, in fact, I've since still been taking N-acetylcysteine, but uh, I, I didn't buy the doctor's best one. And I felt better when I was taking that one versus some of the other ones. So I might go back to that one. Um, and then as soon as I finished the oil of oregano, I started to also incorporate berberine. So at that point, after I finished the oil of oregano, I was taking the berberine and the N-acetylcysteine. Um, so yeah, and all of those have like anecdotal evidence, right? I don't think it's like proper, proper evidence that berberine gets rid of parasites, but there is some anecdotal uh, evidence that it can support um, eradicating a parasite. So there you go, guys go. That is what I did. Um, I do also want to mention that I was um, taking, that I, I really was watching my diet during the, the time that I was taking the Paraguard. I was trying not to eat so many carbs, not to eat so many sugars, even fruits, right? I was kind of staying away from sugary fruits uh, because I really, really wanted to um, focus on not feeding the parasite, right? And just eradicating it fully. So yeah, those are the steps that I took and it looks like it worked. I'm, I'm honestly kind of shocked and kind of surprised. I wasn't fully expecting that it was going to work, but yeah, I'm super happy. Honestly, I'm so thankful that I don't have to worry about this damn parasite anymore. Uh, I am very careful now, guys. I wash my fruits and vegetables before I eat them thoroughly. I wash them in vinegar and baking soda, everything. Not only for the parasite, but also, you know, for all the other stuff that and crap that they, they spray on our uh, fruits and vegetables these days. Um, so, yeah, guys, let me know if you have any questions at all whatsoever. Um, and 
I wish you the best of luck on your journey. Let me know how it's going for you. Um, and let me know what kind of videos you would like to see from me. I'm gonna be in Krakow soon. In the next two weeks, I'm flying to Krakow. So I should have a lot, lot, lot more time to film and edit videos for you guys. I love you guys so much. Bye.